Can you feel the sunshine, guys? I will in a second. Okay, we're ready. Let's get back onto HDMI. Let's go, Sonica. Oh, okay. That doesn't look quite right. Maybe it doesn't like running in progressive scan. Let's see how it looks in the game. Can you see that weird green flicker at the bottom of the screen? Hmm. Showing up on there as well. Damn, maybe I was being too clever trying to run it in this mode. Can you still see it with that? Or does it look okay? Yeah, you can see it. I wonder if I can... There we go. I can just do that and hide it. Hey, we've got a new follower! Uh, Ronin Gaming 123 Pro, thank you. And okay, hopefully that fixed it. I'm gonna have to deal with the green, like flickering line on the bottom of the screen, but hopefully you guys can't see it, so don't worry about it. I think it's actually underneath where the game is anyway. Oh, here it is, this amazing music. Um, I used to be really good at Sonic R. I think uh, over the years my skills may have gone down a little bit. But let's, uh, let's see how we can do here. I used to know where all the secrets were and everything. So the idea is, if you want to try and get all the emeralds at least, is to pick up as many of those rings as possible, and then you can use the rings to open up the doors in the stage. So I think the door around here needs 50. But there's a door over there as well, so let's go to that one and see how many rings that one needs. That one needs 20, so if you've got more rings than what it's asking for, then you can go through the door like that. And yeah, I don't think I've got enough to go through there now. It needs 50. We'll come back. There's also a shortcut here on the right. Oh, I missed it. You can also skip the loop out as well. Yeah. Enjoy the amazing music by Richard Jacks as well. Absolute classic songs. I'll try not to sing along. There we go. We've got enough to go through there now. This is where the emerald is. There it is. Try and pick up the coins. It's kind of difficult to pick all the coins up. Especially if you want to try and get through in first place as well. So, got through in second, not bad. This game gets a lot of crap, but honestly, I adore it. Yeah, so do I, honestly. I'm actually going to go back and turn it up just a little bit, because the music is that good. So. Let's try it like that. And then if I sing along as well, it won't be quite as uh, quite as embarrassing for me. Maybe. <laughs> um, so we got second on that one. We can come back and replay the levels after. So there's a few different things that you can do in the levels. You can play through it and get all the emeralds. You can play through it and get all of the coins. There's also a balloon mode where you go around looking for balloons. There's obviously different unlockable characters. Um, so yeah, let's just go through the levels one by one, then we can come back and get all the extras. You ready for some more awesome music? Hopefully that green line that's flickering on the screen for me isn't going to cause any problems. But it looks fine on the stream anyway. Let's 
I want to. I want to go to a Sonic R karaoke. Try, really trying not to sing. If I was playing this on my own, I'd be singing along. I don't want to embarrass myself that much on Twitch. Ah, oh, three rings off getting into that. There we go. Now we've got enough. There's also like a pinball table section, and there's one here as well if you do a sharp turn at the bottom. Go through here instead. Oh, that one's only 20. You can get one of the coins going that way. And if you go down here as well, there's another one. That's where the emerald is. You can tell how many times I've played this game. That's where another one of the coins is. It does slow you down a little bit going that way though. And then you can join the level again here. And wow, I'm still in first. Awesome. Got to keep that dream alive. Where everything is free, you can't just see. There's one. I missed that one. We'll come back and do the levels again so I can get the coins. Let's take the long route now. And what, the more rings you get as well, the further those boost pads there take you. And let's do the top route this time because we haven't been up here yet. I don't understand why people don't like this game, honestly. I know it's just fun to make fun of, but I absolutely love it. I just wish there was more levels. I know people complain about the controls, but I actually don't think they're that bad at all, really. Right, let's see whether we can get the ring this time. The coin this time. Okay. There's one more. I'm not sure where the last one is. Everything is free, can't you see? Hey, seems like the bit rate's fine. <laughs> Maybe I'll sing along to the next one. Dun, 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 dun. I've got the disco lights going in the background. I should make them go faster. Oh, it didn't count me getting that first emerald. Dun, 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 dun. Maybe because you need to finish in first as well. Let's see, does it count that one? Maybe it's because I haven't got a... Uh, maybe it's just because I didn't finish them first. Anyway, let's go to the next one. I think this one's probably my favourite music out of the Sonic R levels. I'm getting some weird weather effects. I'm used to playing this one in the sun. Go! This is quite a big level if you want to find where all doors are. Yeah, I love this song. Have I got enough? Oh yeah, it's only 20. So, that's where the emerald is in this one. Really easy to get to. You only need 20 rings to get to that one. And then you get to go to this loop the loop which is the only way you actually get to go around there in this stage. Sometimes I ask myself, what am I doing here? What am I doing here? How did I end up on Twitch? But it's still not clear. Oh no! The easiest way to go around there is to use Knuckles. No, I don't want to go that way, I've already been this way. Super cheesy music, but I love it. There's nothing I'm doing, there's nothing to decide Apart from where we want to go Can I make it all the way across? No, nearly! Almost. I can get back up doing that. If I use a double jump. I don't even know if there's any point in going up there really. There's probably a hidden coin up there. Sharp turn. You can use the L and R buttons to turn uh, turn sharper as well. There's a coin. And then jump over there because that's the bottomless pit. Well, it just takes you back down again. And then because Knuckles is getting ahead of us, let's use the booster. No! Did he really? Right at the last second. 
Sonic R in a karaoke stream in one. Yes, sorry. Hope I haven't scared everyone off. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't get to keep the emerald if you don't come in first. Uh, we can come back to the levels. There's only four of them. Oh, I forgot how much I enjoy this game. It really makes me sad when people say they don't like it. I actually used to have it on the PC before I ever played it on the GameCube or the Sega Saturn, so I kind of grew up with this game. And it was actually this version as well, because the GameCube and the PC one's the same. Everyone in the chat, sing along. I don't know why they chose to have this um, sort of music in the game. It's so weird. Uh, the on that's the only difficulty in this game is trying to trying to do a sharp turn like that. You and me and everybody. Oh yeah, you can get the um, electric shield thing on this level as well. Like Knuckles is doing there and stealing all my rings. Get back. Dun, 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 you got to make it real. Got to make it real. Was there no point in going away? This is like. One of the only levels that I don't remember off by heart. There must be some reason to go on that side. Um, I've already been in there. There's another one of those that's like... Like an elevator. Um, and there's somewhere on the right. I think it's here. Yeah. Oh, this one. Oh, I missed it. Is this where the elevator is? I've uh, pretty much given up on this level. Yeah, that's it. Not sure where the emerald is then. Let's try and figure out where it is. It's probably somewhere near the end where the level opens up a bit. Uh, I know there was another door over there. I'm not sure if the coins carry over, or if you need to find all them in one go as well. I still managed to finish second somehow. Music is bizarre, but I'm so happy with what they went with. <laughs> it spits out an emerald that makes you wait a few seconds for it. Where's the emerald on that one? Inside that container thing. Anyway, we better go back to the first level. Got to get all the coins in one go. Yeah, I thought so. So, let's go back to Resort Island. And try and get the emerald. The emerald for this one's inside that mountain at the end. And it's still snowing. Ready, set, go. Oh, there was a bit of a delay then. I don't know if by forcing the GameCube into progressive scan, I've kind of confused it a little bit. Because it's basically using the American version, but turning it into a PAL. Or, you know, doing something weird to it anyway, to get it to look like this. But it means it won't stutter. But yeah, there's a secret area down here as well. I think there's a coin in here. Uh, or not. Ah, uh, I thought I'd be able to trick the game then by going around the side. Let's retry that. Let's pretend that didn't happen. Can you feel the sunshine? Yeah, there we go. It's still raining though. Ready, set, go. go! Let's try going up here. If I remember where all the coins are, I'll try and do a run with all the coins as well after them. Yeah, that was a good start. I can go in here straight away. 
I don't know there's a coin there. It's kind of like Diddy Kong Racing, where you have to try and pick all the coins up. And just as frustrating as well. So I think I need 50 rings. There's also one behind here, if I remember right. Yeah, no. Ah, I missed it, never mind. Let's just try and get 50 by the time we get to that bit. Okay, we got enough. Let's focus on getting the emerald first. Okay, now we're just gonna race to the end of the stage. Even though I took the long way around. But you can skip out the loop. One more lap, I think. Yeah, the sound effects are kind of delayed. That's because of the way I've got it set up, so don't worry, the game's not broken. Well, I mean, the game is broken, it's Sonic R, but it's not broken, if you know what I mean. I'd lo love them to revisit the R formula, racing on foot with branching paths and exploration is perfect for Sonic. Yeah, I agree. It's a lot more interesting than the Sonic racing games that have come out recently. But I think we're the only two people who think that. Okay, we've got two emeralds. Let's go and track down that third one. And let's pick a different character. Let's play as Tails this time. In Regal Ruin. The one with my favourite soundtrack. So, the emerald on this one is up in the corner, isn't it? Oh, Tails is actually faster. Faster than Sonic, or at least he feels faster. A bit more slippery, though. Yeah, the emerald is super easy to get in this one. You only need 20 rings, which is weird. And then you just have to go and stay up here. I think in the next level as well, all you have to do is wait for one of those things to open, like that. So, let's see how many of those coins we can track down. It might be easier with tails as well, because you can, you can obviously fly around instead. There's one. There's one up there. I presume there's another one up here somewhere. It would be a bit weird to let you go up there if there isn't one. There's one here, I know that. On that slope there. Uh, so there's two left to find? There's only two that I don't know where they are. Must be somewhere else in this open section here. There's one. And there's one left to find, which might be through one of those doors. Maybe. We'll probably have to come back and do this one a third time. Ah! Oh no. Okay, let's go this way. It's slipperier when it's wet as well, that's why I'm kind of bouncing around on this level a bit. Oh, he still beat me. We've got to go and do that one again. Weather effects are cool in the GameCube one. Yeah. It seems like it's raining a lot. A lot more than I'd like. <clears throat> I think you can go and change the weather effect actually in the settings. You can turn them on or off. Let's have a look. At least you could in the PC one, so... Let's have a look in options. Game. Yeah, weather. You can choose, like, rain, snow, or clear. I'm not sure what catch-up does. Let's, let's keep it unclear, because we've already seen... Oh, you can listen to the music in there as well. That's cool. 
It's in a little secret passage on the right near the part where you got the first ramp. Okay, let's try that then. Let's try playing as knuckles too. Uh, maybe I'll just play through and get the emerald, just so that we can actually get to the final stage. And then I'll go back through and pick all the coins up. Go. Oh, Knuckles is a lot easier to control than Tails. Oh no, am I not going to have enough rings? Oh wow, perfect! Hey, and now you can see the level without rain as well. It really loves to rain on this version. Damn. I don't know why that made me miss all the rings then. I think Knuckles is my favourite character to play as. Honestly. So you said the area's on the right at the start then, not on the left. Let's see whether I can find it. Knuckles always seem to finish first anyway, so if I'm playing as Knuckles, I've got nothing to worry about. Why do I always keep singing that bit? There's nothing I don't know, there's nothing to decide. Oh no, you can't get through there. Damn it, why am I going so slow again? And Knuckles can't grab onto the wall. Um. So, secret passage on the right as you go past the first ramp. Is it here? Or is this where you come out? Yeah, I've given up trying to come in first. I'm just trying to figure out where it is. I think I'm just taking that bit backwards now. Oh, there it is. So, how are you actually supposed to get there? I still don't know how I got there. I'm going backwards. Let's uh, let's retrace the steps here. Hey, watch out, Eggman! Wait, is that where I just came from? Oh, okay, that really messed that loop up. Am I stuck? Okay, that's broken. Let's try again. You right, went the right way, so I got to go to the right where those pillars are, and then follow it round. Oh, even when it's clear, you get different sort of times of day and stuff, too. So, I'll try and go there first, then. So, down there. And then... Okay, cool, so that's it. Wow, that's a big shortcut, then. Takes you out right near the end. Does that count? Wow, that actually counts as a lap as well. Oh no, I haven't got enough to get through the second gate. Hey, there's another emerald too. Are there two emeralds in this station? Oh yeah, Knuckles is way easier to control than the other two. Maybe I can get two emeralds then if there's another one. I didn't realise there was two. And I can probably get all the rings as well then. Oh, Tails is still ahead of me though. Oh, is it? He's only there. I'll catch him up doing this. Did that count? I hope that counted. There's the last one. And then I can go up here and get the other emerald. Well, let's see what happens then. Hey, I did this level perfectly now. Although I've slipped back to third, so hopefully I can use that speed booster to catch back up. 
No. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, now we get to do the egg robo. Is this his first appearance? I think it might be. Ready, set, go. go. So this is a challenge to unlock the character. And you get them for getting all the different coins in the stages. But yeah, by the time you've got round to doing the challenges, you should know your way around the levels pretty easily. I would love them to do a new Sonic R game. I hate the fact that it's just turned into a joke, so they don't take it seriously anymore. Because it is genuinely a fun game. And especially with it being on the Saturn as well, it was actually really impressive to see it running on there too. Wow, I'm really doing well on this. I wonder if that way is a shortcut. Let's try it. I think it is. It seems fast though. Yeah, it's a lot faster, surely. It takes you out right near the end. Whee! There we go, easy! Oh yeah, Egg Robo was Sonic 3 and Knuckles first, wasn't it? Two Chaos Emeralds. So there was two to find in that one. Is there two to find in any of the other ones? you remember? Let's play as Amy, the only character who has a car, if I remember right. And we've only got one level left. The one with the most annoying emerald to collect. Oh my god, she's so slow. Oh yeah, you can hold down the A button to do a bit of a... Apparently it thinks you're doing a wheelie, but it's kind of like a turbo. Uh, I don't know when you're allowed to use it though, it's not letting me do it now. I never used to play as Amy, so I really don't remember. Oh my god, she's painfully slow. Ah! And she can't steer when you're doing that. And now Knuckles is stealing all my rings. And you can't jump either. At all. So you're just going to go straight into the water there. Okay, it's sort of an amphibious car. Oh god, yeah, Amy has the worst stats by far. But maybe she's good for exploring. Let's see if we can find out where the emerald is. For when we go back into the stage. Oh my god, look how slow she is. Okay, there's a coin up there. I think the emerald's in here, right? Oh, is this just where there's another coin? No, there's no more than that. <laughs> With the speed shoe, she's almost the same speed as the other characters are normally. Is it over there? Is it that? No. Let's try this way. Maybe that way. I don't think I went that way last time. Is it? Or is that just taking me around in the circle? That's just taking me around in the circle. Is it in here? Oh, how did I get up there? Is it up here? No. Uh, the emerald's in the machine, but it takes ages to come out. Okay. I think I've got another lap. I can go and wait by it. wonder why they made that one take so long. How do they get to it again? Is it up here? I can't remember how I got to it. Huh? 
Do I need to go through the door first to activate it, maybe? Oh, it came out behind me. Okay. Makes sense. Maybe. I may as well finish the level, I think I'm on the last lap. Oh wow, I timed out. Okay, I know where it is, I'm not going to play as Amy this time though. Do you know if there's any other stages with two emeralds as well? Unless they all have two, I really can't remember. I did 100% it in the past at some point, when I had it on PC. Let's, uh, uh, let's go back to playing as Sonic. It is his game after all. And now it's clear, but night time. So even if you do set the um, the weather to just show as clear, it still has different effects. Oh, I missed it. I probably shouldn't have gone that way to start off with. Let's do that again. I can't believe how quickly I finished Sonic Mania earlier. I didn't even realise it was the final boss. But I'm glad I got to play Sonic R, because that's secretly what I really wanted to do on this stream. Okay, I'm supposed to wait for that door to open. Not sure how many rings I need to open it. Where? Why is it sending me straight into the wall? I always used to hate that one. Yeah, Sonic Mania was just a ruse so that I could play Sonic R. That was secretly my aim of this stream. Lure people in with a good Sonic game. And then show them an actual good Sonic game. Well, no, they're both good. Okay, right, I need to slow right down here and then go to the right. And then... Ah, it won't let you slow down because it thinks you want to do a spin dash. Yeah, got it. Oh, I think I took the wrong route then. Now all I have to do is worry about trying to get back into first. That will help. Yes. I thought that was the last lap, I still got one more to do. Let's just keep on going around the normal route. And I think that's the last emerald in order to unlock the final level at least. And then we can get another awesome song to jam to. Whoa, how many rings am I picking up here? It didn't even stop collecting them all. Hmm. Yeah, it's good, right? There's two emeralds in every level but the first. Okay. Yeah, that explains why there's three slots left. I wonder why the first level hasn't got two. Yeah, don't tell me yet. Let me see if I can figure out where they are. Did that unlock the final stage? Or do I need to get the other ones? Yeah, it did. Annoyingly, you can't see which emeralds you got. But anyway, let's go and try the final level. That's the only thing I dislike about this, the fact that there's, a, there's not really many stages. Like, they're fun to replay, because there's loads of different paths and stuff. I love this level, and the music. 
It felt really special the first time I got here. Because obviously I didn't used to be anywhere near as good as this at the game. So it did actually take me a long time to find them all. I always used to struggle with pressing the L and R buttons to do the tighter turns. Although I missed all of the rings there. I think the emeralds up here somewhere. Did I get past it? Oh no, it was just one of those stars that was tricking me. There's no emerald up there at all. Is there two in this level as well? Whoa. No emerald up there either. I'm pretty sure there is one. I'm just not sure where it is. Hey, Knuckles stole all my rings. Oh yeah, I'll show you some of the other modes in this game as well, because they're really fun too. There's like a tag mode where you have to chase the other players down. And the, the fun thing about that is you don't really have to follow the level on the set path. You can basically go wherever you want. You just have to try and find them. Which is really fun. And you can do that in two player as well. No emeralds and no coins either. Oh, what's the point of all the extra doors that you can go through then? Just interest in different routes through the level. Oh, I wish I had a memory card in there so I could uh, record my unlockable characters and stuff. this way. See if we can catch up with Knuckles. Or am I going to have to play this one again? Is that it? Did I come in first? Yay! The doors are shortcuts. Yeah, I think so. So there we go, that was the entire of Sonic R. Thanks for playing. And you get that lovely Sega Saturn 3D render of Sonic too. So I hope you enjoyed that. Now I'm going to show you a few of the little extras. Well, maybe I'll go and find the other emeralds. What should I do? And then the question is, what Sonic game do you want me to play next week? Now that I've finished Sonic Mania. And Sonic R, technically. Um... I don't really know where to go next. Shall I move on to Sonic 4? Or shall I play some of the Sonic Advance games? What would you like to say next? See next. Yeah, I love that Sega Saturn model as well. I love that low poly aesthetic. I wish they did do a full 3D Sonic game. Not like Sonic Extreme though. Sonic Invention Rush series would be cool. Yeah, that'd be cool. I want to do the Sonic Adventure games at some point as well. I don't know if it's the chat that's lagging or the, uh, the actual stream itself. Hey, I got a follower. I think that was lagged as well. Yeah, so one minute ago. Uh, thank you to 
Messac boy. I'll just make sure I read that right. Yay, thank you. Sorry if I butchered your username as well. Oh my god, it won't let me skip this. I'm I'm trying, I'm trying. Just enjoy that Saturn era music. Cool. Yeah, I never used to use Twitch much either, so it's kind of weird that I'm on here now. But YouTube's still my home. It will always be. I did consider streaming on Twitch on YouTube as well, but apparently for games it's it's a lot better to stream over on Twitch instead of YouTube. So that's why I'm here. And it seems fun so far, so thanks for thanks for coming over. And I've got a new video coming out tomorrow as well, so I hope you look forward to that. Come on, is that it? Please don't say we have separate GameCube um, credits. There you go, you get a nice extra picture at the end. Uh, I'm sad that the memory card was full, so I can't save it. I might see if I can find a better one. Yeah, it's only a short video tomorrow. It's going over some books that I got recently. That are really, really cool, actually. <clears throat> Let's see. If I try and save this, will it actually let me save? Oops, I almost went over it. Not enough free space. Requires one file. And four blocks. Let me see if I've got another memory card. Let's try this one. Let's see if that one worked. Nope. I've got a few of these boxes full of memory cards. Let's try this one. Uh, kids these days. Wrong device inserted. They don't know the struggles. <laughs> Uh, that one's corrupted. Damn it. Uh, let's try another one. Yay, I found one. There we go. Found a memory card. Finally. And now let's go and find those other emeralds. As Knuckles, because he's the easiest to control. So you're saying the first one didn't have two, so there's a second one here somewhere. So... I know there's one down there to the left. Maybe you can give me a hint if you've got the locations for them. I'll see if I can find them without though. The thing is, they're usually behind the doors that take a lot of rings. So it's not something you can try and find beforehand. I think there's somewhere on the right here. Maybe. Yeah, in here. Oh, that's. I already went through there. That's just where the coin is. Well, at least it wasn't many rings. So, let's see if there's anything else further down here. Okay, that is just a shortcut to take you back out again. Is there anything in this area? No. Another coin. Well, we can try and aim for the coins as well. 
I should probably keep track of which uh, which levels I've got the coins in. Anything back there? No. And then it comes back out. Okay, so it's not to the left when you go in. Is it where the pinball table is? Is it up here? Ah, no, but there was something up there. Uh, I wonder if I can see it from up here. There's another coin down there. Oh, I can't jump down. Okay, I'm finding the coins at least. Let's try going this way. So, drop right down in the corner. Where does this go? So, that is just another way back out. I know, I'm going backwards. Do you need to finish first with all the coins as well in order to get the extra characters? Can't remember. I'll try and jump over that so I can keep my coins for the doors. Okay, there's nothing up there at all. So next, let's carry on up here. Uh, is there another path there? No. Although you can see through the floor there. Because <laughs> they didn't make the mountain go all the way down. Whoops. Okay, I'm back here again. Somehow I haven't found either of the emeralds. Oh yeah, one of them's up there. It? Is there a coin? There's one emerald up there. Oh wow, I didn't think I'd be able to get all the way over there in one go. So, I'm still none the wiser on this stage. Let's try it again. It needs to be first for the characters. They're both behind doors, one's near the start. Oh, I never actually finished first to get that one anyway. I should have been taking notes. Oh, that is the only one I didn't find. I don't remember where it was though, damn it. Why put replay before retry? So you don't see the one you already found before. I don't remember where that one came from. Oh, it was at the top, wasn't it? Around where the pinball bit is. I've got it. I know where it is. Let's see if I can get to it on my first lap. Yeah, more than 50, that's all you needed. Yeah, perfect. Let's see if I can jump all the way across again. Yeah. Oh no, I didn't have enough rings to go through there. I'm just going to run through the other two laps just to get that emerald. Then we can come back and get the coins. You know what, in some ways, I would even argue that the single player in this is more entertaining than Mario Kart 64. I know that is a very controversial statement. But I feel like there's more to do, there's more to explore and find out in this. Like there's just secrets everywhere, which makes it really fun to play and replay. I've finished this game so many times. Final lap now, let's see if I can get a speed record. 
I suppose you want to play as Sonic if you're trying to get a time trial record. Now, is it faster to go down there and back up? Or is it faster to go this way? I don't think you can jump all the way over from there, though. It might be faster to go from the top and just glide all the way across, actually. And then I presume going on that speed booster is faster than going across. Yeah, Mario Kart 64 is a bit empty in places. <clears throat> Do you even get anything for getting all the emeralds in this? I can't remember. So. So we've got all of them in that one. Got all of them in that one. Did we get all of them in here? Did we get all of them in that one? I can't remember which one. Do you remember which one of these two we got them both in? Oh yeah, of course, Super Sonic. Yeah, I think I got Regal Ruin as well, so let's go to this one. Oh yeah, because the only one I found on here was that thing that slowly opens in the middle. So, let's go exploring. Uh, <laughs> that didn't work. I swear the other emerald on this one is inside one of those elevator areas. It's been a long time since I've played this, so... I haven't seen any doors yet. There's nothing there. Is it that? Is it that thing over there in the distance? Let's see if I can get over there. Can you even get over there? I don't think you can. No, you can't get there anyway. Okay, it's not that. Is it down here? There's a weird runway that goes nowhere. It must be somewhere out of, like, the main area. My hint is to take left turns after the first emerald. Okay. Well, the first one's here. Let's get the first one. Wait for it to spit it out. Oh, no, it's not going to spit it out, is it? So. Left turns after the first emerald. Ah, there's a door there. Am I going in the wrong way? Oh, I haven't got enough rings. No! Okay, let's come back there. See if it is that. Ah, uh, does it appear on the top of that submarine then? Yeah, there we go. Got it. Thanks for the hint. I don't know how I didn't notice that door was there. Let's try again now then. 
Is that the last one then? I'm sure they said there was two more. Oh, we get a nice sunny weather to do it into. Go. So I think I needed 50. Right, which well, should be easy now I've got this. I suppose I don't need to trigger the first emerald, do I? I can just run past it. Uh, oh, almost didn't make it there then. Yay, easy. Now we just have to run to the end. And then I'll come back and get the coins. I'll try to. The coins are the hardest bit because you still need to finish first. And they're really difficult to get in this one because they're all tucked away in awkward places. No, I actually picked up a coin. Uh, one more lap, is there? Or two more. So there's a coin there on the left, and then there's one directly on the right there as well. And there's one on the right up here. Hey, that was pretty good. There's a coin up here as well. I know there's a coin in that room. Pretty good final lap. So is that the last emerald? Are we going supersonic? Yeah, that was the last one. Yay! Now do we get supersonic? Maybe? Oh, Sonic turns into Super Sonic. There we go. There's no fanfare whatsoever. That's weird. Now I don't remember which one we got the... Uh, which one we got all the coins in. Pretty sure it wasn't this level. Yeah, I don't remember having to stop it there. Well, yeah, Supersonic's fast. I'm only half paying attention, that's why I don't... I don't remember what level we got it in. Is there a coin in here? No. Wow, yeah, that's crazy. The other... The other characters have no chance of catching me up. Uh, there's one over here, if I remember right. Yeah, right. Okay, one more. Oh, I know where the last one is. It's on the top of that bit, isn't it? Oh, you can run across the water as well. No way. Yeah, the last one's just up here. Oh, hey, easy. No, let's leave these suckers in the dust. Oh no, what if I do that? Let's use the speed booster. Whee! Wow, yeah, Super Sonic's crazy. Now we get Metal Sonic too. I'm sure with Super Sonic I'm just going to beat him instantly. Let's see. They should have a different different music for the uh, character battles. 
That'll be fun if Metal Sonic had his own theme tune. Oh my god. He has no chance. Don't need to pick any rings up, do I? Ah. Wow. It didn't even matter that I messed up. Let's see if I can jump over the trees. Wow, I'm so fast I can just jump over the trees. Oh yeah, I can stand on the water as well, can't I? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Did I overlap him? I think I just did. Wow. That's crazy. Have you seen the Sonic R Mania mod for this game? Really cool texture pack that changes the course visuals. No, I didn't know that. That's cool. I presume that's for a PC, for the PC version. Let's try playing as Metal Sonic. What level did I get the coins in? I can't remember. That was Regal Ruin as well, wasn't it? Go! Uh, I don't think I can get on there yet. Oh, now Sonic becomes Super Sonic. In the races too. That's cool, that'll make it a bit more challenging. Not that I want it to be more challenging if I'm trying to get the coins. I'm just trying to remember where they were. There's a coin to the left there, isn't there? one to the right here. It's two, and then there's one to the left on the slope just after the start. Uh, go through here, there it is. And then do a U-turn. Hey, there's Sonic again. Hey, again, he can go over water. That's cool. Right, two more. I know where one of them is up here. Where's the last one? Don't think it's up there. I don't know where the last one is. Try and keep going, it must be on the second part. Down here. Uh, over there maybe? Damn it. I've messed up now. Oh no, it's there! It's there! It's there! Turn around! Come on! Go, 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 go! I don't think I'm going to do it though, he's got too far ahead now. Let's try. Come on, keep that dream alive, we can still do it. He's only there. Ah, oh, I'm getting scared now. Come on! Yes! Just did it. Okay, now we get doll tails. That was close. Yeah, yeah I'm so glad I did that. I managed to find all of them. Now I'll just stick to the path and use the booster at the end. That was close. How can people not like this game? It's just so fun. Even the way you unlock the characters is cool. Trying to, you know, hunt through the levels for the coins. I know some people don't like the controls, but I actually think it controls pretty well. Once you get used to it. Let's take the speed booster. Whee! Wow, I think that was like a perfect lap. <clears throat> I think you do slow down a little bit in the water. Though it's still best to jump over it.
try and jump over there, so take the faster route. I presume that's the fastest route to get through that section. Although you should probably jump at the end so you don't have to do that booster twice. Final lap. I can't remember where the other modes are. I know I was talking about the balloon mode and the tag modes. They might be under multiplayer, but I'm pretty sure you can play them in single player as well. I know when Sonic Gems Collection came out, a load of people were upset. They were like, you know, there's only one good game on there. No one wants to play Sonic Fighters and Sonic R. But honestly, I've put Sonic Gems on more to play Sonic R than I did Sonic CD back in the day. A reverse walk backwards would be so useful for the coins. Yeah, that would be, that would be cool. Let's try playing as this Tails doll. So, oh no, the only level we've got left to get all the coins in now is Reactive Factory. The hardest one. This might take a few attempts, but let's see. Oh, wow, the jump on this is like non-existent. I thought he was going to float like Tails, but he just has a really weird sort of like someone's picking him up almost feeling and he's flopping all over the track like that right gotta try and concentrate now see whether i can find out where they are don't think there was one of them oh you can hover that's why it feels weird okay kind of is it unlimited? Maybe. Kind of like Knuckles then, except you don't come back down. Right, there's one in here. Let's see. Oh wow, he has like no deceleration. At all. He literally can't decelerate. Okay, <laughs> I'm not going to play as him for this one. What are your thoughts on Sonic the Fighters? I don't think it's a great fighting game, but it's still charming. Yeah, they're basically my thoughts on Sonic Fighters 2, like, it looks nice, I like that Sega Saturn graphic style, but in terms of a fighting game, it feels a bit like you're not fully in control, if that makes sense. Yeah, I'll try and do this one as Knuckles, because he's a lot easier to control, although he still does the spin dash when you try and stop, which is a bit annoying. See if we can find the optimal route here, so you could probably go right a bit more and go through that tunnel to get the other one that I found earlier there. I don't know, Sonic with Fighters is okay. It's not great. Uh, is there something over there? I'm just going to use this time to explore a bit. I really thought there'd be one here. Just where the emerald is. There's one there, so if you take that corner sharper, and then there's another one there. And then I think there's one on the right in the second, in here. Yeah. And then the last one is where I tried to take the Tails doll earlier. Which is up here somewhere. I think. Yeah, I didn't want to play as, as Super Sonic. That does feel a bit like cheating. Where's the last one? 
I think I've missed it. What are these two doing here? This is supposed to be the shortcut area. I think I missed the last one. I can't remember how to get back there. I know it's on the top somewhere. Oh my god, maybe I'll actually still be able to get them. If so, that's going to be really easy. Although, Sonic is Super Sonic. Uh, have I missed it again? I was supposed to do a sharp right there, I think. Yeah, I missed it again somehow. Oh well, there's the end of the stage anyway, so I'll come back. Hey, he's not Super Sonic anymore. That's weird. Maybe it's random. Come back, table. There we go. Oh, yeah, I forgot the fan was on. <laughs> Blow my hair on my face. Ready, set, go. set, go. I'm just going to focus on getting to the first one now. Figuring out when I need to turn to get to it. Is it bad I'm having more fun playing this than Sonic Mania? That's bad, isn't it? Not there. Have I missed it again? Where the hell is it? There it is, right. How do I get up here then? At the start. I haven't got the friends. Okay, I know where it is. Yeah, even though the heat wave's gone, it's still too hot to just function without a fan at least. We did get air conditioning, but it's in the bedroom to cool it down. We got one of those portable ones that you can carry around the house with you. Well, not carry around, it's on wheels, but you can wheel it around. I've got one annoying bit of hair that's escaped my headphones. Uh, I think I made it worse. Oh, I used up all my rings, but somehow I went the right way. Let's see if we can come back there on the second lap. Probably going to need to do it again. I only need 20. Probably do that bit first though, because it's the most awkward part. Because the way you have to stop and then reverse back on yourself. Uh. Got it. Right, now let's see whether I can find the rest of them. So next one is over here. That's three. Oh, I could have done that better. I think I just got hit from behind them. Oh no, I forgot where I'm going. That's not the right way, is it? over there either. I can't remember where the other ones are. No! Now 
now I can find that one. Now I don't need to find it. Nighttime looks really cool on this stage. Yeah, it does. Retry, retry. I've got to remember where the other ones are. <clears throat> oh yeah, I haven't played as Eggman yet. He's fun in multiplayer, if I remember right. And in the tag minigame. Oh yeah, I think the other one's somewhere on the left near the start. No, I didn't need to go that way, did I? There's nothing over there. There's the other one. more. So one of them is the one in the thing up here that's annoying to get to. And then the final one is to the right near the entrance. I think I've got it this time. Oh, I thought that would run me out of range then. I need 20. Easy. Let's see whether I can just run straight at it. Yes, perfect. And then get out of there as soon as possible. Oh no, where's the exit? Ah! What? Are there two? Oh my god, why did I get so confused then? There's two. Shoot, maybe I've messed up there. The camera confused me. Oh no, I've lost now. They're probably already near the end. Come on! I've got 85 rings, so I'm giving you a good boost on here. There's Sonic! Oh, is he a whole lap behind? Yes! Yes! I'm in first! Yeah! I did it! Yay! That's all the characters! Woo! Yeah, I love it as well. Here we go, here's the final character. Uh, it is... Floating Knuckles. Did they run out of ideas? I don't think it's tedious, I think it's fun to, you know, try and figure out where you need to go and in what order. I really loved it in Diddy Kong Racing as well, where you have to collect all the coins in the single player mode on that. That's why Mario Kart feels kind of empty in comparison, like, apart from the racing, there's nothing to try and focus on. There's nothing interesting like that to give it a bit of longevity. At least not in single player. <clears throat> so yeah, I think I'll always put Diddy Kong Racing and even Sonic R above Mario Kart 64 for that era. The only Mario Kart game with a good single player is a DS one because it had the mission mode. And I guess Double Dash because I fell for a rumour that if you completed it with every single combination of characters, you would actually unlock the N64 tracks. I think a magazine said that once, and I fell for it. But it meant that I put in hundreds of hours into Mario Kart Double Dash. Because I was tricked, goddammit. At least putting time into this game actually gets you something. Apart from just getting you an awesome soundtrack to listen to for an hour or so. I 
I don't know if that's the fastest way to go by turning right there, but it feels like it is. So the last lap. Yay, one second slower than the other one. Ah, uh, yeah, I was so disappointed when I found out that doing all that in Double Dash didn't actually get me anything at all. I just felt cheated, felt lied to. And I think that's everything. I think that's the entire game. So let's see. Yeah, here's some of the other things. So there's a tag, tag the characters. There's normal and reverse time attacks. And there's also another thing, if you want to try and track stuff down, which is popping five different balloons in each stage as well. So let's have a go at finding them. Although I don't think you get anything for doing this. It's just for fun. Let's have a look. I don't mind cheating playing as Supersonic on this bit either. The balloons are all in really weird locations as well, if I remember right. Oh yeah, I forgot I can just walk straight across the water. This one. See, they're really off the beaten path. But I don't think there's any sort of time limit or any sort of direction you need to go. You can literally just wander around the levels wherever you want to try and find them. Which is pretty fun. Just exploring. I don't know what happens with the doors. Whether they're just permanently open. They might be. There's one. There's one. See what I mean? They're just really well hidden. There's probably one in the forest. Let's go and have a look in there. I'd be surprised if there wasn't one in the forest. I say forest, there's like three trees. Ah, no, there isn't. I couldn't see one anyway. Uh, I can't remember whether they're always in the same place or not. I just know I like the idea of just needing to just explore the levels completely. This one. I think they're just put out of the way, like in places you wouldn't expect to look. And then obviously you can... Maybe it is randomised, because I think the idea is to try and find them in the fastest time. I haven't been up here. I don't know where else to look now. There's one more somewhere. Nothing here. I don't know where the last balloon is. I don't even know if you get anything for doing this, honestly. There it is! Maybe the flickies were pointing me towards it. There you go, you just get a record for finding them, so I guess you can try and go and beat that if you really felt like it. I'm not going to go through all the levels, but that's the idea. And I'll show you the tag mode as well. I used to enjoy playing this one. Let's pick a different level, let's go to the ruins. So the idea is the characters just run around randomly and you just try and tag them all and then they freeze in place. So you can see some of them are facing the other way and they have to go and try and track them down. Although with Supersonic this might be easier than it should be. So that's all you need to do. Where did he go? So it is literally just like playing a game of tag where I'll just 
run around and try and avoid you. Ah, uh, maybe it is still difficult. Where's he gone? Get back here! Yeah, I used to really, really enjoy playing this one when I had the game on the PC as a kid. Because you can see them on the map, so you kind of got an idea of of, uh, of where they are. So, there's just Knuckles left to find. I think he's hiding, because he's stood still. Um, the thing is, though, with the tag mode, you can't go through any of the secret doors. They're all blocked. But yeah, it's such a unique idea. I've never played a racing game that's done anything like this before. He's around here somewhere. There he is. Oh, it's not Knuckles, it's his weird robot version. Where's he gone? He's copying Metal Sonic from earlier. Got him! Yeah, it'd be fun if it was online. But that's the idea of that one. And then you've just got the normal time attack forward and backwards modes as well. And I think... I think that's it. I think I 100%ed the game. There wasn't any sort of fanfare or anything. Yay, there we go. Completed save file. So, I guess I'll leave it there. I've been streaming for nearly three hours now. I've played all the way through Sonic Mania and all the way through Sonic R, 100% complete. So, thank you for sticking with me. And I really enjoyed playing Sonic R as well. So, I'm glad I got to share that with some of you, share my love for this game. So I'm going to end the stream here, come back next week and I'll decide what Sonic game I want to play next. And I'm also going to be playing through the rest of Klonoa 2 as well. And the fan is blowing the hair into my face. So that's it for me for now. Thank you for stopping by. I uh, hope you enjoyed the stream. And yeah, I presume with a 100% thing, you just have to play through the final level again. But maybe I'll do that later. I'm going to end it now and go and chill out for the rest of the evening. So... Bye, everyone. See you all again soon.